Hey, y'all. Today I want to talk about um, this guy, Stephen Pruitt. I remember seeing him online a lot, going around about how much he had contributed to Wikipedia as an edit editor and a, and a writer. So, yeah, I mean, it says in, he's made 3 million edits uh, on Wikipedia and 35,000 original articles. Um, it's, uh, it only has 5.7 million articles in English. And um, I guess this guy, Stephen Pruitt, uh, was named one of the most influential people on the internet by Time Magazine because one third of all English language articles on Wikipedia have been edited by Stephen. So he's edited a third of all of these of all of these articles. So he's kind of got a big hand on the information. Everybody who shares Wikipedia, if you ever read Wikipedia over, let me show you something about Stephen Pruitt real quick. Stephen Pruitt is a contractor for U.S. Customs and Border Protection. And this is according to Wikipedia, saying how he edits a third of articles on Wikipedia. I think he would keep an eye on his own Wikipedia page. And this is from his uh, LinkedIn profile. And it says he's been a lead trainer at Immigration Customs and Enforcement. He's been a uh, team lead at Immigration Customs and Enforcement. Uh, government support specialist at Immigration and Customs and Enforcement. So he's training people at ICE. Yes, ICE. Concentration camp, ICE. And his licenses include a secret clearance at U.S. Department of Homeland Security. So next time you, you read Wikipedia, just in, in English, just know there's one out of three chances that you're reading the editing work of a somebody who trains people at ICE. And, you know, is that in with the United States government that he has a, um, a license of secrecy with the Homeland Security? So when you read Wikipedia, just know that you're reading the work of an ICE officer. And I've noticed that he really likes to include like US funded NGOs and like say Radio Free Asia. I'll save that for a different video. But you know, but I noticed he never, and any say controversial takes or like, you know, disputed takes, he never shows both sides say like from uh, another government, you know. He, he might do the most basic stuff quoting that government, like a constitution or something, but he won't, he won't use this, like any both sides of a dispute. I've, I've noticed that quite a bit, and we'll get into some of these NGOs later. I've noticed he, he's, he cites Radio Free Asia, and that's going to be a, a, a different video I'm going to do. Keep that in mind. You're not going to see the full story when you when you read Wikipedia. Now, sometimes there are, like, you know, just sources on there, decent sources. He'll, he'll source things like New York Times, and it's like, okay, you know, then you got to go find sources in there. Yeah, I, I just want you all to understand that about Wikipedia, that it's, it's being edited by an ICE manager, somebody who trains people at ICE. All right, I'll see you all later.